I love stories. I love storytelling. I think that's why I doodle a lot, I sketch a lot, I draw a lot. And I see photography as something similar. Photography is a way of storytelling. It's a way to communicate your ideas, to tell people your stories. To me, a picture paints more than a thousand words. Kiki. Having said that, I always tell my students to have fun in whatever form of photography. We take pictures of food for all sorts of reasons. It's to make it look so good that you would want it too. To make it look so good that you feel hungry just looking at it. Now food styling is important because it adds nuances that your brain remembers. The greens, the flow of the egg yolk, the fresh and bright ingredients that makes up the whole food. Before coming to Nikon school, I've actually bought a DSLR, but I really have no idea how to use it. But after coming to this course, I know more about the camera and I have more confidence in using it now. Ali has a great sense of humour and his class is interactive. I had a lot of fun. One, two, three. Here are some tips for a few drooling moments, courtesy of Nikon School. Food photography requires a lot of light coming from a single direction, mainly from the back or the side. So if you have a mirror or a white sheet of paper, use it as a reflector against the light. In food photography, you want a shallow depth of field. And you achieve that by choosing a small f-stop number or a big aperture so as to give the impression that the food is so mouth-watering close to you. To find out more, log on to school.nikon-asia.com and join us for this fun-filled voyage of discovery.